What is going on everyone? It's Mike again. Welcome back to the channel. It is a beautiful sunny day in Ohio and today is going to be the first video of working on my excavator. We are going to be removing this thumb cylinder from the machine. Shouldn't be too difficult. We're going to pull this pin out and pull the pin out down there and then remove this hydraulic line here and the one on this side. So I'm hoping it really won't take too long. Hopefully the pins slide out pretty easy and uh, we can get this removed. The reason I'm removing the cylinder is as you can see down here, it's all wet. This cylinder is leaking. So we're gonna take it to get new seals put in and uh, hopefully after that, it should be okay. Okay, so we're gonna start by removing this little cotter pin right here and start pounding on this pin to make sure it comes out and then we'll hit that pin down there. So I've got both of those pins pretty much as far as they'll go like that. I'm gonna use this pipe in a second here. But before that, I wanna remove these hydraulic lines and get them off. So we just got off that fitting. Let's head to the other side and we will remove the fitting down here. Okay, so we just got that hose off. While I'm here, I'm also gonna go ahead and take off the hose from right there. I think I'm gonna buy a new hose. Okay, so we've got that hose off entirely. Let's go back to this side and remove the hose from right there. All right, so now we have all of the hoses off of the cylinder. We can go ahead and take the pins entirely out. I'm gonna go ahead and grab some cloth and just wrap these uh, pit, these little hose ends right here. Uh, both of those, just cover them up and make sure they don't get damaged. So let me do that. All right, I just grabbed some pieces of uh, like old t-shirt. I'm gonna go ahead and try to wrap these around those ends so they don't get damaged. All right, now that that's done, I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of these pins out. Okay guys, I didn't get any video of it, but I just did get the cylinder out. As you can see, that side's out, that pin's out. I'm going to attempt to collapse the cylinder a little bit and uh, take it off the machine so I put this up and we'll see if I cannot lift this thing off it's pretty heavy all right guys I'm exhausted I just got that cylinder off I had a friend help me but we took the cylinder off and carried it over to my truck but now what I'm gonna do is take this chain and basically flip this thumb up chain the top of the thumb up to this um, where the pin would be up here and that'll hold it out of the place that way I can still actually even move the machine around if I need to All right guys, I would say that's a success. The uh, cylinder is out. I've got a chain in there so that that doesn't fall down. Here's the cylinder in my truck bed. I've got it wrapped up just for now. I'm gonna be taking it to the shop next week to get repacked. All right guys, while I'm at it, um, I also got this gas shock that came in today. It's for one of the two gas shocks that are under the engine covers. They just completely fall down and they don't stand up. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this and hopefully install that as well.
the gas shock right there is not working. I have to use this piece of wood to hold up the engine cover. So I bought a gas shock. I believe it should be the exact replacement for that one. And I'm going to remove that and install a new one. So here's the comparison. Here's the old one. You can see it's all dirty and obviously it just doesn't work anymore. Here's the nice new shiny one. So we'll go ahead and put the new one back in. All right, so we've got the new one. We'll put this back in now. new gas spring is in there there it is it looks great and what's important is that it works so I will close the engine cover as you can see it's closed we will press the button and voila opens up perfectly fine and I can get in there and work on it I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did hit that like button hit subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video bye